Hello everyone, welcome to another video. This time I'll be talking about the new control net models that are coming up. And basically we are going to navigate into the Nicobill GitHub website and we are going to get uh, the explanation here of what these models are. These are the T2I adapters and you have the canny, the sketch, the segmentation, the key pose, the open pose, the color and the style. And these are very interesting, the color and the style because these are new things that we didn't do before. So I'll be explaining how to use this and how to download them. So basically you come here into the Tencent website, I mean into a hugging face a repo and get these models from the model tab. Get, get all of the models, download them, and you're gonna place them inside your uh, stable diffusion extension, CSD, web UI, control net and inside the models folder where you have all your uh, control net full, uh, models you want to place them here and then you're going to come here and change the respective name that Miku Will is explaining here you have the T2I adapter underscore canny underscore SD14 uh, V1 you're going to grab that name you're going to Grab the sketch adapter V14 YAML and you're gonna paste that, uh, replace that name. You're gonna make a first a copy of this file so you don't mess the file. And then you replace the name of the copy for the respective one. So the canny will be a sketch, the sketch will be a sketch, the segmentation will be image, the key post will be image, the open post will be image, and the color will be the, the new this new adapter color and the style will be a style okay so uh, these files will be already inside your inside your uh, folder and the other thing you got the depth model right if if the if they haven't updated yet this what you have to do is basically the depth model he didn't explain so i think it's gonna be image so i'm gonna go into the image okay what we're gonna do here is basically uh, copy this we copy the image adapter and we coming into the depth one click here copy and then into the image copy here we're gonna replace the name with that of the depth map okay you probably noticed that i also have the 2.1 maps here like the head sd 2.1 and that's because we also got like yesterday we got the, the depth maps, uh, actually the control net maps, uh, courtesy of T-Bot Zamora. Uh, I don't know if I butchered the name, but basically uh, you just get these uh, files from the from his repo on, on Hogging Face and download the safe tensor ones that are 730 megabytes. And this will work inside stable diffusion in, in automatic 11 web UI. So I'm gonna start the automatic 11 web UI. Okay, once everything's load, um, we're going to the settings and in the control net, you're gonna need to enable, uh, you need to change this line here, the last part. You need to put instead of 1.5, 2.1. And this file is already inside your folder because if you update for the newest um, update of the extension, then you will have this file in your in your folder. And this is to play with the 2.1 model that I have here. I, I have the 2.1 Sense 6 8 uh, not MA Prom or whatever. Okay, so we're gonna load up a prompt that I prepared. I don't know if I really prepared this prompt, but. It's a prompt that might work in the two in the two point one, and we can place it there. Okay, cool. And that went went away. The thing that we need to do now is go into a control net. And we are going to open one of those things that I was working before in the last video. 
we're going to enable it and we're going to use the open post 2.1 uh, safe and remember if you're going to use the script in the in the blender then you would you will need to uh, copy this name some files i think it will work the same and let's try with this prom let's see what it what it comes with so Um, as you can see, my my thing comes, uh, it gets damaged at the end. I think that's because my buy is is selecting one buy there that, that is not the one. Let's put it into none. I also gonna put this in 896, 896. So I have to uh, probably come here, 896. And as you can see, that's such a better result. Like you can see the hands are much better and this will require very little fix, I think. Uh, Amazing, I think. Uh, let's see. Let's go into into the other things that we need to check out and settings. We're gonna put this in one point five. Actually, one point five, not one one five, and apply the settings. And we're gonna go back into text to image. Um, Maybe we're gonna use the same prompt, even that this one was made for 2.1, I think. It's more 2.1 than 1.5. I'm gonna go in another video on how to make prompts because I think uh, even myself, I need to get more practice with the prompt. Like people is overestimated, not actually people is making fun and it's actually very funny this uh i i gonna try to find it because Ray. um yeah the the pro the pro guy i don't know if you have seen the beep <laughs> this is so funny well uh basically we have this guy here that but people is making fun, but really the prompts are really important. So we're gonna we're gonna make a video about how to make prompts and and see like explore a bit more because it's uh, something really important. Let's go into let's go into the into the thing that we were doing and yeah. So here we're gonna change this to the one point five thing. The open post. We're gonna use that one and the same thing and let's do a render actually we need to change or or model oh wow we have this um rpg let's try that okay i was saying that i have the rpg before there and i'm gonna try with that model that's a 1.5 model and here i select the the t2i <laughs> the t2i adapter for the open pose because we, we before we were trying the 2.1 and now I want to check with this and next I'm gonna go into the control the other control net mode if you want to do multiple control nets as I, as I was saying before and this is possibly the last time I say it that you can have multiple control net by putting more sliders here and these ones are the ones that are saving to your cache into your cache if you have a big cache like a 1390 or 1490 then use this like three if you want i gonna go here and as you can see because i have three three multiple modes i can use up to three if i have four i can have another tab here if i only have two then i will not have the, the model two there okay so what i did is like basically here i'm gonna choose the style 
the style adapter because I want to have this picture, which is an artwork by William William Blake. I want to have his style into my into my barbarian guys that, I, that I'm rendering with Control Net. So I'm gonna enable it, the T2I adapter style, and in the first mall I'm gonna use this. If if it's too strong, then possibly we can go here and actually let's do it. Let's let's download like up to up to eight. Let's put this into seven point five. And this one the same. Let's put it on seven point five. Because in the Nico build it says that this might be too strong. So let's let's do it in point seven. And ta -da, generate. Okay, we have a problem. Let's see what's that. Okay, okay, okay. Let's go into. So we need to go into a processor here and select one of these processors. I think I I think. For this, the clip vision will work well. So let's select the clip vision. And sorry, I had my dog barking and I have to to uh, do the thing. But basically, it's picking up the style. It's just too strong. Let's let's put it a bit less, like 0.5, and generate. And now it's too weak. <laughs> Let's go once once more. Maybe put it on eighty five and start from from point two. And yes, it's starting to pick more the style. Let's put it a bit stronger from 0.15. So it's this is again trial and error, and you have to find your own your own. Yes, that's what I wanted. You know how good is this? This we are on the money, man. <laughs> yeah, great. We did it. So I hope you like this video. Let me know if you want to see more things like this. Um, I was talking that my that we may start doing like prompt prompt tutorials also because or maybe I will do like the small ones and the the capsule tutorials for the for the prompts. But there is a lot of new things coming up. There is uh, some very interesting thing with the. Latin couple and um, there is a guy on Twitter that has amazing let me see if I can go in, into yes this guy Nia Con is she she or he got um got this this thing going with a lot of very cool information actually if you haven't tried Confi UI I haven't also tried Confi UI but it's another system for a stable diffusion and this has like great possibilities and it's looking amazing, I think. I want to install this. Um, there is a lot of things coming and as you can see, it's uh, advancing at break making speeds and there is too much things to go, to go through. If you want me to do a tutorial or talk about something, please let me know and please check this. Uh, this resource is like beyond what I can even tell you. It's like I'm learning from this one. Um, Toy X XYZ, which also does a model, is an amazing resource. Also, he always posts uh, very cool things. Um, myself, if you want to see things, also, I don't know, AI, AI entrepreneur. Anyway, thank you very much for watching and please subscribe. Bye bye.